Hey there YouTube family, this is Jane Mazimba and welcome back to my channel. If you're here for the very first time, then subscribe, but welcome and thanks for stopping by. So today I am doing another chit chat where I answer a question off of our social media. I have a question from a lady on Facebook. She said, I have 20,000 kwacha, I owe 50,000 kwacha, do I invest the money to make more money? or should i pay off the debt if you know anything about me and my history with debt and um, my journey to being debt free you know that instinctively i want to say pay off the debt okay because usually debt is very expensive not just um cost of money wise as in interest you're paying on the debt it's also very expensive mentally and emotionally because it's constantly like a a burden that you're carrying with you everywhere you go if you're like me you can't even go out to a party you can't even go out to chill with your friends at a restaurant and be like hey living my best life because you're owing people and you're like hey i'm living my best life these people that i'm owing are going to look at me and think why isn't she paying us but of course i need to be objective about this so should you as well you need to be objective so my first question is is your debt due now or is it due later in the future? Do you still have time in between now and the time that you have to pay off the debt? If you still have time and it's not due immediately, then go ahead and invest your 20,000 kwacha so that it can earn you a little bit more money, okay? Also, is your debt accruing interest? If it's incurring interest like on a daily basis or a monthly basis, then you want to get rid of it as quickly as possible because in the long term, debt is very expensive. You will be hard pressed to find any sort of investment that gives you a return that is as high as how much you're paying on debt. Let me give you an example. You go to a microfin, you take out 10,000 kwacha at 25% um, interest you will be hard pressed to find a place where you can put the same amount 20,000 kwacha i mean 10,000 kwacha where you will get a return of 25%. Generally you will get a return of 12%, maybe 18%, 20% if you're lucky and you're really really clever about how you're investing. So debt is expensive if you can get rid of the debt first, okay? The second thing I want to ask is, have you spoken to the person you are owing? Okay, so if your debt is not due immediately, or even if it's due immediately, but it's not incurring interest, then you can go back to the person you're owing and say, listen, fam, um, I know I'm owing you this much. At the moment, I've got this much, but there's this investment that I want to get into and it will earn me back this much and i will pay you this way so you negotiate how you will repay if it's earning interest you negotiate where the interest stops accruing and so you have a little bit more time or you restructure your debt in that way get creative but talk to the person you are owing okay you don't want to be that person who owes money and then you just never pay and you dodge phone calls it's very bad for your reputation at some point in our lives all of us are going to need some sort of funding and you're going to want to ask, you know. So you, you're going to need to borrow somewhere. So you want your reputation intact. So before I go away, I also want to mention that repaying debt also becomes a mindset thing, okay? You, you know, if, if you get used to postponing debt, it might become a problem because if I feel like, oh, I can postpone paying this month, I'll pay next month, let me reinvest this and you make your money back. It's also that much easier for you to then say, oh, even in August, ah, let me postpone, I'll pay in September and let me repay the debt. Um, forgive my son, he was out. You can hear his voice because I'm a mom and I'm proud of that. So there's a little guy that's about to enter. Um, so you want to build a mindset and discipline of repaying what you owe okay so you want to build this mindset where you learn how to repay off the debt you don't want to be that person who gets comfortable owing people people being angry at you and you're comfortable with that no so be careful on how you invest this money so we want to be careful with how we repay that debt and how we restructure that debt don't get comfortable owing people 
okay don't get comfortable you know just being this person who carries this burden around so it goes back to mindset it goes back to discipline and it goes back to how much research you have done so that's my answer i hope that it makes sense yes babe um it takes long to come back that's why that's why i didn't come earlier okay okay my baby so comment below <laughs> In the comments tell us what would you do would you repay the debt would you reinvest how would you go about doing it if you like this sort of content do give me a thumbs up um, like this channel subscribe to this channel and share with all your friends and family until next time